Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to do a video on five full things you need for fall. Yeah, fall in love with five things that you need for fall. Or fall obsessions or five essentials you need for fall. There we go. So I normally look for a nice jacket, a nice pair of boots, um, a good perfume, um, I love shades. Shades would be in my, one of my essentials that I would need. Um, as well as, I said boots, perfume, and a bag, and a bag. We need bags. Okay, so, today I'm going to be showing you exactly what I bought this full. First thing, um, perfume, okay. So, I recently purchased, I know you saw in my last vlog, if you guys didn't see it, check that out. Um, I bought the YSL Libre Perfume. Um, this perfume. Now, when I first smelt this perfume, I was in love with the bottle. I didn't know if I was in love with the scent. This scent smells like a bad bitch, period. Okay. This smells like, actually, to be honest with you, it smells like an editorial magazine that you're flipping through. You know how you smell the inserts of the perfume? That's exactly what this smells like. A walking magazine. That's what you smell like. I personally love that scent because I love magazines. I love Elle, Vogue, Harper's Bazaar. I love them. I get a subscription of those all those magazines to my door every single month. Um, and... I love this perfume. This perfume is totally badass. This is a statement badass perfume, badass bitch perfume. This is pull up perfume. This is everything. This is for a strong, independent, um, not backing down, no bullshit type of woman. BS, no BS type of woman. So I'm totally embracing that. That's who I am as an individual. Anybody that knows me already knows. Um, but. I love this perfume, and this one is my pick for this full. Love it, okay? So, oh, by the way, Sephora is doing, I don't know if you guys saw, Sephora is doing, if you buy $50, I think it's, believe it is, if you spend $50 now, you get 20% later. So, check that out, looking at, I find I found that on Trend Mood Deals. Check that out, okay? And that way you could get 20% off, you know, towards your purchase, if you haven't picked it up. Good perfume. My next one is my shades. So my shades, I bought this full. Um, I bought, this is Lux. I bought Dior. Um, now these are the Dior Soul Lights. They come in this packaging. And they are absolutely, I bought them off of Farfetch. Um, and they look like this. These are bad bitch shades. I know I still have the tag on them. I should totally take the tag off. That way you could guys can get an idea. But I definitely bought them off of Farfetch. Um, and I caught them on sale. Which you should too. Now these shades are... Oh, okay. There. Mm. Bad bitch appropriate, okay. Love, love, love them. Um, I haven't worn them yet, so they're going right back in here. But they're super cute. I adore them, and that's what I picked up. So my next one, boots. Depending on what type of person you are, whether you will do a boot that is high-end or... Not high-end. I want to say with a heel or um, just a chunky boot. I decided to go for some Doc Martens. This full, and I bought. I did buy. I did buy a pair of boots that have a heel on it. So I did buy them, but I didn't include them in this video. You can pick whatever kind of shoes you want. But um, I bought the Doc Martens, and these are the Jadon boots, and they are super cute. They're super black. Um, they're black matte all around. I love the way they look. They are super cute. Um, I bought mine off of Dolls Kill. So if you're interested in purchasing them, um, I paid $180 for these. Oh, matter of fact, those shades are $425. 
Um, and the perfume, I think, is 125 No. Yeah, something of that, re that nature. Um, these are 180 um, I would try to catch them on sale if you can, since everybody's doing the Black Friday sales, especially Dolls Kill. I know they have a 25% off um, if you catch them in stock. Now, with these boots, I would suggest going a size down, only because um, they are full size. They are German made shoes, I believe. So, um, normally I wear a size 8 in female women's, um, size 5 and a half, 6 in boys, young kids, adults, young, young kids. Um, but these are in a size 7 and they still give me enough room. Um, they're not tight at all. They're super cute. They're super matte. They're super black and they have a chunky heel and I just love them. They're super cute. They go good pretty much with any outfit and help you to keep looking badass so highly recommend next um one is the bag so this i picked up a while ago this is um a bag from zara it still has the wrapping and tag on it it was 80 dollars at the time 79 um this is a statement bag it's a fanny pack i like fanny packs because they give you great style without having to compact so much. I love fannies. I love the way they look. This one's a statement, so I always get a statement bag. Um, whether it's a leopard bag, um, I'm just using this for showing purposes. But um, I think you'll get any type of bag that you like. If you want to do more of a um, luxury bag, you know, leave in the comments what you're interested in. I would like to know. I'm interested. Um, but if you want to do something on the one end, not seeing this is still expensive, eight dollars. I don't think they have this available anymore. But I thought this was super cute when I first saw it. I purchased. I haven't worn it yet. Um, I actually took it off the box the other day. I'm a hoarder. Um, so I buy a whole bunch of stuff. Um, anyhow, I love the fact that. Um, this is a statement bag. I can wear it around my, you know, stomach or I can wear it as a pouch as well. And it will still dangle and it gives you that little edge biker style because it has the fringe. So I would definitely go with something, um, that you can use, um, and goes well with anything. Like I love leopard, especially around the full time. Um, you can't go wrong with leopard, camouflage, denim, those kinds of things, leather. So I would do something like that nature to get a statement bag, any thing of your choice. But this is my bag that I got for this full. I do have other bags, but for showing purposes, this is what we do. I highly recommend a statement bag. And the last thing, I know I did a whole um, video on outerwear. Thank you guys for the love and support. I appreciate that. More videos are coming on looks. Last thing, this is an additional jacket that I did buy. Um, it came after I did my haul of outerwear because I have an outerwear obsession. Check out the video. Um, but this is an all black jacket. It's super pretty. It has fur lining. It goes all the way down. I'll insert a picture of the girl that's wearing it from Nasty Gal website. I bought this on sale for $115, I believe $120. Um, it looks, I love the way it feels, um, and it's badass, like, I was a nasty gal, the, I think the original price is a black aviator, it's called the Vinyl Aviator Coat, I love vinyl, um, it gives you a sharp, dressy look, it looks good, even like on this white background, look how bomb it looks, it just pops, um, it makes you stand out, I love vinyl, hence you should do a, a vinyl bag as well, um, and I love the fox fur detail inside. It's super cute. It's super warm. And I feel like you can wear this with anything. It has buckles on the side. I will insert a picture like I said. But I highly recommend getting a badass jacket for the full. And yeah. Super pretty. Super cute. You can't quite see it. I'm going to show a picture of the girl. It has a fur trim on the bottom. It has a fur thing. The whole inside is fur lined. It's super cute. Um, I highly recommend. And yeah, 
that's pretty much it you guys so it's my five full essentials that you need for this winter i hope you guys all enjoyed i will be check out for my silent videos please subscribe like comment please give me a thumbs up um i appreciate you guys so very much i love you guys so very much